Hi, this is Sid Grover, your Lake Chapala Information Guy, an exclusive buyers only realtor. Today we're going to be taking a look at the plaza or the square at Hokotapec, which is on the far west end of Lake Chapala along the North Shore. So we're starting here at the uh, at the, across the street from the plaza. We're going to pan around and show you some of the beautiful old uh, arches. And that's a restaurant right there you're looking at now that sells, of all things, goat stew. Believe it or not, there are three goat stew restaurants on the plaza, so goat stew here is very, very popular. Here's a uh, shot of the beautiful old church. I understand it's over 150 years old, and you see how tall it is. And the palm trees, look at the palm trees. They're also as tall, almost as tall as the church steeple. Uh, looks like maybe six stories or so. You'll notice that uh, as we uh, film this area, uh, most all of Hokotepec has nice smooth streets, either hot top or asphalt or paving stones or paving uh, brick. And we're going to pan around now and show you the buildings along the, the east side. And back to the uh, north, you see the mountains are behind the, the plaza here. Most of the North Americans who live in this area do live in the northern section of town. And there's the kiosk, or the kiosk we would say, or they, we would also call it a bandstand. And now we're going to move on down and look at the... Uh, municipal building here. This is the, uh, Hoko by the way is both a city and the, what we would call a county. So the city of Hoko and several other small cities are actually inside the the county of Hoko Tepec. And now we're just about where we began so uh, We'll move on to the next clip. Okay, now we're going to walk around the perimeter of the plaza and show you some of the shops and some of the folks uh, doing their everyday business. There's, there's flower stalls, uh, lunch counters, and they make fresh juice here every day. Lots of stuff for kids because there's lots of kids. And you'll see children out. It's noon time. It's about time for the schools to change uh, from one shift to the next. Got a little traffic jam here. A stationary store called a papeleria where they have supplies of all kinds for the kids and, and for making stuff. They're very creative people and they make things out of a lot of things out of paper. <laughs> and there's a, a photo shop here and a lady making good things to eat and, I, and the shoe store looks like and it goes upstairs too and an ice cream parlor everyone loves ice cream you scream ice cream everyone screams for ice cream this is a nice one, and uh, there's a lot, I think there's three or four ice cream places on this plaza. This is just one of them. Moving along, kind of a, a this and that store, kind of a five and dime type store there. And now we're going to cross the street, move on to the north side of the plaza. where there's a cellular store and another little restaurant look like it might be a little more upscale and not doing as much business as the one we saw earlier a handbag uh, place and a 
mochilo or backpack place. Lots of backpacks. Another restaurant with a big kettle. Well, something good being cooked. Looks like they're making the ladies back there making handmade tortillas. Hola. And a dress shop out here on the out here on the covered uh, plaza walkway. Like everywhere, uh, a lot of the shops cater to the ladies and their styles and dresses of all kinds. Coming up on another juice place. If you have a card table and something to sell, uh, you can open a business here, uh, at least if you're a uh, Mexican national. Okay, here we are back at the, back at the uh, municipal building. And that'll give you a flavor for the plaza at Hocotepec. And uh, thanks for watching. This has been Sid Grovenier, your Lake Chapala information guy. And remember to check us out at www.chapalaclub.com. That's Chapala, C-H-A-P-A-L-A, -A club, C-L-U-B, dot com. You know, membership has its privileges. All for now.